morning, guys. Okay, so today I've come upstairs to do some tidying up of the kitchen. So I'm going to be cleaning inside the cupboards so that we can get prepared for actually putting our things in there. Um, I can't put everything in at the moment because there's still the cupboards that Gala needs to come and do because of the lift up. Um, they haven't done that simply, that's our fault because there's no power. The, the, lift up, the lift up drive needs to have power in the house to be able to function. So they're waiting for us to do that. So as soon as we've done that, then they'll come and fit that. But that doesn't stop me cleaning out the cupboards and arranging some stuff. So I'm going to do that today. Um, we have been spending a lot more time upstairs here recently, guys. Honestly, like then I've got a little rocking chair in my office at the moment. Um, the sofa's upstairs in one of the boys' room. Um, just one of them, anyway. And we've just we've been spending a lot of time during the day up here, mostly during the evening times. Then we kind of go downstairs when we kind of like want to sit down and settle a bit and stuff like that. But for the most part, we've been up here and quite a lot, which is nice because we all have our space and we're not disturbing each other. So it feels really great to be up here. So yeah, um, everything's going well. Um, you know, trying to do what we can do. You know how it is. So anyway, I'm just gonna get on with it. This is my toaster. We bought this toaster, I think it's been well over a year now, and we've never used it. It was from my favourite shop ever, Sainsbury's, you can see right there. <laughs> um, it's a four slice toaster, but I'm not sure if this is going to fit into my, um, you know, where the kettle and toaster goes. I don't know if it's going to fit, so I'm about to take it out of the box now to see if it will actually fit or not. More polystyrene. Mm -hmm. that we bought right it's silver and now that I've been a lot more into kind of like interior design I don't know if I like the fact that it's silver anymore I'm not sure I don't know I don't know how I feel about it but anyway it's here so it's here but I don't know if I was buying it now if I would buy this same one I'm just not sure but I just want to see if it will fit at all because this is quite big it's quite bulky what do you guys think? Do you think it will fit? I'm not sure. Let's see. I think it's going to fit. I think it's going to fit. Hey, hey. It does fit. It does fit. It fits. Kwame, you were wrong. It fits. <laughs> no, I'm not wrong. You said it wouldn't fit. You said you don't think it will fit? No, what I was looking at is the toast and the kettle. Where are you going to put the kettle? The kettle goes up here. And the plug socket. Yeah. But to be honest with you, anyway, if this, I know because loads of you had concerns about, oh, but you can't do that because um, you can't boil something in here and put to and do your toasting in here. It, to be honest, we weren't actually supposed to do that. That was not the purpose of it. It was just to hide it away afterwards. So it's like, I can't remember what someone said, a utility garage, that's what, I like that. Yeah, someone said it's a utility garage, so you just put it away. So honestly, if I was to use this, I would just, I'd actually pull it out and have it plugged in. It would remain plugged in and I would just pull it out to use it. And then when it's cooled down and everything, then I would put it back. That's what, that's what I had always planned to do with it. I wasn't actually gonna leave it in here and press it on and let it toast in here because I feel like that's probably quite dangerous. So that was my that was my thinking behind it, but yeah, the kettle won't fit next to it, but I don't know, as long as I can just put it away. Like, that's all I wanted. I just wanted to be able to have it away so it's nice and out of the way. Isn't it an expensive space? No, because it's a space. It's not because I hate uh. kettles and toasters and stuff being on the workshop. So for me, this is perfect. That's exactly what I want. I want it hidden out of the way. When I'm done, everyone's done. You put it in there and it's packed. It doesn't mm. need to be. I don't like these unsightly I things. Wish, yeah, okay. I wish that if we did it a bit more and understood what you actually wanted, mm -hmm. I would have actually pushed the, the actual wall unit a little bit out. What, what is out a bit more? Yeah, so basically what I'll do, I'll put a back panel just alongside the corner uh -huh. and then take it out by at least um, 10 centimeters and then start the cupboard. So we push it out so that, you know, so open the door. So you imagine that there's a void, that void that is there of yeah. 10 centimeters at the back. Mm -hmm. Now you've got a way that we can do a mechanism tray. Slide oh, it out, okay. I see what you mean. put the stuff in, toast it and then slide it back in. Out. I mean, it's one of those, I just don't want it on the worktop. That's, mm. that's my, I just don't want it on the worktop. I just want it hidden away. 
I think there's probably only one item that will be on this, this worktop and that's probably if we get a really nice special smoothie maker or like a coffee machine. I don't drink coffee but you know it looks nice. So a coffee machine or something like that. Yeah, I drink coffee so you, yeah, you drink purposely coffee, I used, yeah. Yeah. So I just want it just tucked away basically. That's my that's my ultimate aim and I've achieved it so that's mm. what I want. But don't you think that just if you just bring the toaster out and put it there it would not look nice. No it wouldn't. Let's try it. Have you tried that, it? That's yeah. disgusting Kwame. Oh no, I'm not. I'm. I'm. No. It, 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 that, word, look, that word is disgusting. Is a harsh word. It is though. It's disgusting. I mean, no. close it. Close. Close the cupboard. That, that looks so. Yeah. You see, and then have the kettle next to it. Now all your workspace is getting smaller and smaller. Like, that doesn't look nice. And that big workspace is getting smaller and smaller. Yeah, it is though. <laughs> that doesn't look nice. Uh, okay. Do you see what I mean? This is. We're looking at design as well, and I think it just doesn't look nice there. So, yeah, but I know there's, I mean, there's design, but you don't want your place to become a show house. It it's be not practical. a show house, but I want okay. my kitchen, I want my kitchen to be that way. Okay, I hear you. I get you. Obviously, I'm going to use it, I'm going to cook in it, but I want it to be like a showpiece, so I want it like that. I didn't pay that price for this kitchen for nothing. So. Yeah, if I knew that, then we could have had, um, um, they call it a back kitchen. I hate the word servant kitchen, oh. really, but just a, a back, another oh, back yeah. kitchen. Yeah. You know, it could, it could have gone through here. Through this door yeah, yeah. to go through. Anyway, that's that's another design for another. Anyway, you know, so no problem. Anyway, um, I'm gonna clean in here first. So I'm gonna get on my cleaning. Thank you. Uh -huh. some house help um, but I realized um, that I didn't really have the money to do it so I found a difference um, an alternative situation <laughs> this one comes free of charge now that I've seen that he can reach the top covers in I couldn't read you that I've seen that he can reach the top covers in hey my friend <laughs> <laughs> you see that? You see how it works? I don't need house help anymore. See? I save, save myself some cash. <laughs> Money saving tips. So you know when um, you're glad that you bought something in the past and it now serves you in the future and you're just happy you did it? I'm so happy that I bought these, okay? So I bought these from Sainsbury's when I was in the UK. So this must have been about, I'd say probably about nine years ago now I bought these. And it's still in its box, it hasn't been used. So I have quite a few of these Pyrex dishes. And I'm so, so, so happy that I have these because I would need to go and purchase these because I'm throwing away all our plastic containers. You know when you go and buy a takeaway and the takeaway comes in those cheap plastic containers that break and they crack and all that. Now I don't need those anymore. I'm gonna chuck them all away and I'm gonna pull out my set of these because I have a couple that are different sizes. I think I have about six of these. So these are great for like, casseroles, lasagnas, whatever, storing your stuff in the fridge, going in the oven, everything. So, there you go Pyrex, I'm doing an advert for you. See that, free advert. Can we not be shabby about it as well? Well, or should we take off all this? No, but I just got it. I just got it, I just took it out of the box. Yeah, it's I got know, the stick I'm just saying, no, oh, yeah, yeah. Just, I'll take it off. This and we, yeah. Now, some people would like to, you only buy a sofa. We leave the plastic on yeah, the chair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just take all this. <laughs> yeah, I will, I'll take, I'll take this label off, obviously, but you know. I just want you guys to know that it's, it's pirates, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so these will all go into my cupboard. So I'm so, so happy that I have these. In fact, I think I gave a couple of these away to my mum before I left. Now I wish I kept them. <laughs> Is that selfish? <laughs> but these were a really good deal. These, I bought these from Tesco's. They were doing some offer. You collect these sticker things every time you go shopping and then you got a discount on them the Pyrex dishes and now I'm just so happy that I have them. I'm so glad. And I'm just glad to have a space to actually be able to put them, a functioning space to put them so I can actually have all my stuff out. This is like amazing because I've not been able to unpack boxes and I don't know, I'm, I'm, it's like Christmas for me because now I'm so surprised and I don't know what's inside a lot of the boxes that we have so I may get more surprises like this, I don't know. Let's see. Oh, 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 oh,
just found these little bloom things inside all the cupboards and I was wondering what it was. So I just sent an, um, Gala a message and I was like, what are these things for? They're like in all the cupboards and she was like, they're hinge caps. Okay, she didn't say it like that. I'm saying, I'm doing this because that's what I would do probably if someone asked me. They're like, they're hinge caps. So I'm just going to fit these on. I'm going to see, or I say me. Kwame's going to put them on. Let's see if he knows how to do it. Trying to get the name right. I don't, I don't like things starting off right there. Done. Finish. Oh, there you go. Look at that. I just want to take it off. Artistry. Yeah, take it off. That's it. That's it. But it's a good mechanic. This one is really good, very good. You know why? It protects these. Yeah. You know, especially you could be near a beach and this could rust. Mm -hmm. So it's just a little protection before it, you know. Wow. Yeah. Galvanized as well. This is this like. Zinc, galvanized zinc or something, so that's nice. Like so that. now, Kwame can go around and fit them all, can't you? Isn't that amazing? Wow, you're gonna be amazing. I know you're gonna do them so well. So good at doing these. Oh, wow, look, look wow. Oh, Kwame, wow. look, you've Kwame, just fitted yes. two. Look. Oh my gosh. I've got a lot Here you go, do. a lot more to do. Maybe a hundred. Look, here's some more. Here's Ooh, some more. Where's that come from? See, he can fit them all. Ooh, look at that. So this is the box. The blue hinges and these ones are for the side. These ones here are for the side somehow. It goes here basically. Yeah, yeah. It goes, it's for here. Yeah, bang it. I can't do it. Someone has to hold the camera, so we can't both do it. So that's why I said you Oh, I like it. Good. You do it. You've been really good at it. There you go. You give it a try. Look at that. Isn't that simple? But you didn't clean this cupboard very well, or you have to go over it again. I didn't touch this side. Remember, you started that one. Huh? Pardon? Yes, dear. <laughs> Here you go. I don't remember. Okay, so for the meantime, I have decided to, to put my plates into this cupboard down at the bottom. I haven't opened them yet, still. They're here. But just so that they're not on the worktop, just so we can keep this place as we mean to go along. I'm just going to stick them down in the bottom of this cupboard. So I'm just going to lift these into here. Why? Yeah, look. Okay. So I'm just storing them. This is the kitchen cupboard. Hold on. If I stand up, perhaps you can see better. There we go. I'm just storing them down there for now. So there's my first items I put into the cupboard, but one day I'll open these and put these away properly. But as you can see, I'm a little bit OCD about things, so look, I have to face these the right the same way. <laughs> because otherwise, it will irritate me if I don't do it. It will just irritate me so much, so I just, like, that's why Kami doesn't really enter the kitchen. Um, because he knows that if he does, goes and does something in the kitchen, I'm going to be like, can you go and turn that thing back around that way, please? I have this, these um, things that just, oh, the dust is so I have these things that just irritate me. It's just me. This is how I am. So, yeah, anyway. It's a bit warm today. Yeah, yeah, I'm here. And you as well, you're hot. Yeah. yeah. So, I've also decided to put my Pyrex dish here. So where I'm sitting, because you probably can't sit on camera, but where I'm sitting at the moment is the sink is right here behind me. So it's the, the down cupboard opposite it. Oh my gosh, this boy's climbing around my feet. Yeah, it's the only place in this whole house that you can find to play is right next to my feet. Anyway, it's one of those things, eh? But yeah, so I put my dishes, my dishes and my pirates bowl here for now, but I'm really not sure where I'm going to actually place my stuff in this kitchen, to be honest with you. It's quite a difficult one. I didn't think I was going to have this issue, but... Because I really want to put things where it makes sense. So I feel like if I'm cooking here, if I'm cooking here, and then I'm going to put my stuff, I guess plates should be in this, in this cupboard then, right? Plates should go here. Um, so I guess maybe the Pyrex dishes, when I bring them all up, those like container stuff, I'll put them in the cupboard next to it, not this one. I don't know. I'll probably do the kitchen and then change it around like a few times before I'm happy. But that's okay. It's okay to experiment, right? But yeah. Oh, and let me show you my chair. <clears throat> this is where I'm now. I'm now going to be sitting. So when I come up here, 
When I come I'm here and I want to be all alone, I'm going to sit here. This here is my, um, it's a bit broken, I don't know what happened there. Um, but this is my chair, my nursing chair from when I was pregnant. So I, bought, I actually bought this from the UK and I should had it shipped here for me. So I'm going to be sitting here for now until this is a proper office. So I'll be sitting there and oh, chilling out here. It's a nice rocking chair. Do you know what I mean? Here we go. See, now I'm sitting here. He wants to sit here. Okay, you sit there then. I'll watch you. I'll stand up. You sit there. How about that? Yeah? Cool. He's sitting there and I'm standing up. Great, yeah? Yeah, so... um. That's my nice little chair that I've got there. And I'm trying to bring up some more stuff. Um, what I'm trying to do is, I'm, try I'm actually sorting out downstairs, but I don't want to put it on camera because like downstairs is a huge mess. I tidy and it becomes really messy. Then I get tired and I just leave stuff on the floor because that's just how we roll here. You know? So downstairs is extremely messy. Um, I'm trying to get rid of like loads of toys that the children have had when they were younger. I mean. My daughter was three or four when we came, so you can imagine the amount of toys and stuff that she's got that's just there now. It's just become redundant. No one wants it. Yeah, I've got toys. Yeah, you've got toys, yeah. So, yeah, the stuff is just downstairs. So I'm literally just sorting through what's broken, what can someone else can use, and it's a huge mess. This was the only room that we hadn't kind of cleaned up and it was full of crummy junk. Like it was like rubbish and tools and all kinds of things in here. So I've just got him to get everything out basically. And then we, we swept and we mopped. Yeah, and Jaden. Yeah, so we swept and we mopped in here and now it's looking nice and clean. So I'll be able to bring the books up another day, but not today because it's now 4.30 going to five and I'm absolutely wiped out, tired, knackered. So this is the room. Good luck to you. <laughs> this is the room, so now it looks nice and fresh. I don't want to go in there because the floor is still wet. But you can see it looks so much better. And look, I've been working in here because this room is where the internet is the best. Like no disconnection. So I think internet is another thing that we're going to have to work on when we're moving up here because although you can get the internet from the living room area, sometimes it kind of like it's a bit sporadic, so it comes and goes, and it's a bit annoying. So I'm going to have to get some type of booster or something, but when you're in this room, I mean, you have no problems. You sit there all day, every day, that an issue, but yeah. So we need to sort that out, so we've got some things to do, and I'm going to do some more tidying up downstairs. I've been up here like the whole day, and I'm wiped out, tired, knackered. But anyway, guys, if you haven't already subscribed, I would appreciate it very much if you were to just hit the subscribe button for me and the notification bell, and don't forget to do me a favour and like this video. I'd appreciate it very much. Until next time, I'm out. Oh, <laughs>